Hey guys, Rev it up seven here. Um, we're gonna be showing you some cool cars we got at the flea market. Sorry we haven't uploaded in a while. Um, we've been on vacation and we've been getting a bunch of cars from this flea market, but we've been going every couple days and we didn't want to keep making a bunch of small videos, so we thought we'd wait a while and make a big haul video instead of a bunch of tiny stuff. So this one's actually worth watching instead of like three cars every video. We got a bunch of stuff. I think we got like 30, 20, 30 cars, at least 25. A lot of cool stuff. Uh, not 25, let me see. 1, 2, 3, 4. I think it's 21. Something like that, not 30. But we, it's a lot of cool stuff. We got some in the box, some out of the box. Uh, yeah. Um, we're still here for another two weeks. We got some bad news. We didn't get any Velocity X cars. Yeah. That's like our thing every time we go to the flea market, but we didn't see any this I year. I think you guys have been looking forward to that, but yeah, I'm well, really, really Velocity sorry. X is kind of like our thing on the channel, but we're still looking. We still got two more weeks of going to the flea market. They have them all the time. So we'll, we'll keep looking. Hopefully, hopefully people get the new. Yeah, hopefully people get new stuff, not the yes, same stuff. The same yeah, whatever. But um, today we're gonna be uh, looking at these. Let's just start. We're not gonna spend too much time on each one, so we cut down on a, a time limit. Well, here's each. go kart. I guess. Yeah, this it's one's. What's one. this called again? I think it's just called go kart. We found them at the yeah, bottom. Just of the bin. Yeah, just go kart. Yeah, it was at the bottom of the bin. The back wheel was busted, but we we fixed it a little bit. This is the one from Turbo Racing. Yeah. It's a pretty cool little He's car. Nice it's really tiny. And we have a red one, by the way. Yeah, we have a red one. Next up, we got, I think this is, uh, what, what was it, Fangster? Yeah, I think this is Fangster. Fangster. Something like that. I used to think it was called Evil Weevil, but then I realized that was like a Volkswagen. Um, yeah, because I think this is the first edition for this car, and it's become like one of the most popular feature cars Hot Wheels has ever made. Yeah, the, the chassis drags a little bit. But, uh, the exception to that is a pretty cool car. Moving on, we got this. I don't even know what it's called. We got um, Sky something. I don't know. I don't know. It's a cool bike, Sky Cutter. I've some, been collecting something like that. I, I'm not sure, but yeah, oh. he, he he's been collecting Hot Wheels bikes for a long time. Yeah, since I was born. Yeah, but I actually don't know what this is. He got it, but I think it's, it's cool looking. Like Jet Threat the bike. Uh, another bike we got the one from Accelerators. I still don't, I don't know what this was called. I need oh, to get my names down. What's his name? Pork chop, right? He pork chop, it. pork chop rides this. It's but silver it's, instead of green. I don't know what it's called. Something hammer. I don't know. Not jackhammer. What am I thinking? It's cool though. I just found it at the flea market. and I was like, oh man, I should get this thing. Yeah, it's a nice chopper. The engine sticking out, a little chopped rear fender. It's cool. Um, oh. we got this uh, Arkham City or what is the thing? It's from Batman vs Superman. I don't know. We got this Batmobile. It's pretty cool. Plastic body, metal base. That's my favorite setup for cars. I just like the feel of them. Um, it's pretty cool. And not much to talk about. You guys have all seen this car. We got the Formulator from Hot Wheels Beat That. The exact. To be honest, that's one of their cars. That's probably my second favorite that I've got here. Um, I love the deke. It's in great condition. All the little intricate stripes and stuff. The two logos right there. Oh, I just found out something. It says eight right there. Cause get it for me later. Yeah, eight. Right. You didn't okay, know that. I didn't there's know two that. eights. There's two eights here too. Even there's one sticking out of it. Cool car. I it's um, from Beat That. Yeah, I said that. It's the exact version. Oh, you did. We got this purple passion with real riders tires from the Springfield Police. One of those three pack things or five pack box sets. I'm not sure. I think they're treasure hunt. Looks like a treasure hunt. It's got a little blue logo on the back. It says Springfield Police on top of the number 27. It's cool, Super classic, chopped hunt. coupe. Really nice. Really nice car. Love the white wall tires. Um, next up, we got this Ferrari Testarossa. I love this thing. I found it. it was probably, it's the most recent car I've gotten. It's Honestly, I hate the paint job, but I've always liked the Ferrari Testarossa. It's got the classic uh, black wall, classic wheels with the air scoop and then I just always like the look of the Ferrari Testarossa. It's in good condition. We got Shadow Mark II from Beat That. This isn't the exact version but we already have the exact version. This is my favorite part this, of the game. This paint scheme is the exact replica of the real Shadow MK or not MK I always used to call it that. The real Shadow race car. Um, that's actually a real thing if you guys didn't know. It's got all the sponsors on the side. I don't know if those are real. Yeah they only got good real, good real Goodwill, Goodyear tires, Valvoline, is that what it's called? Something like that. STP and some other stuff for the sponsors. Wheels. I've been seeing those for a lot. Yeah, these are like the the new classic wheels. They're on like everything. 
with shadow on the spoiler, which is pretty cool. Okay, those wheels are on here. Yeah, they're like their generic wheel. Right? What do you think? Even on here? Yes. All right, whatever. Nice job. Sorry. I keep knocking it out of focus when you bring stuff back in the camera. Whatever. Um, next up, we got this cool Aston Martin 177. Uh, with redline tires, this is a Walmart exclusive. I used, I thought it was a treasure hunt at first because I'd never seen something like this before, but I don't know, it's really cool. Better look at it. Metal flake, uh, metallic paint, really cool. Nice Aston Martin. It's just really good looking car. Reminds me of the DB, DB11 from the new movies with the chrome. and It's a really cool car. Um, you got a couple ballistics. I'm trying to collect every single ballistic ever made since it's my favorite car. We got this one from a recent five pack with, oh. the, with the Hot Wheels race team colors. What? Um, I actually remember seeing that before. Uh, oh, what the? Freaking fly. Idiot. Uh, next up, we got this uh, matte black one with white tires, like a ghost one from the Hot Wheels test facility. I remember when that was like their big thing. Never was really a fan of the whole Team Hot Wheels thing, but I like the movie on YouTube. Um, got this Team Hot Wheels one. I like this one. I'm not a huge fan of these wheels. I never, I actually don't like these wheels at all. But I like the spray paint, uh, paint job. Uh, isn't he on that computer game? Yeah, the the Hot Wheels Stunt Track Driver, clone, like clone yeah. on the Flash game. Like you have to buy money or something to get it. No, you don't. It's a Flash game. You don't have to buy Flash games. You don't. No, but you got these three, three, these three ballistics. Three more that I don't need to look for. Just pretty cool. You got this Road Rocket. These are, my, these are my favorite wheels, these little like razor blade wheels. Uh, Road Rocket's a great track car as you can see from some of our other videos. This one's cool, yeah, got a glow in the dark looking body. I don't know if it actually is glow in the dark. Uh, you got Shadow Jet, not much to talk about. That's about it. I just yeah. like how Shadow Jet, the spoiler's part of the body. Except there's a logo on that. Yeah, it's a little yeah, Black Hot Wheels logo. I like how the early uh, 2000s and late 90s cars were like, I don't know, I don't know what, what series this is from. Why do you keep doing? You keep like talking. I don't know. Uh, the car. You keep acting like the cars are talking. I don't get this. You're the one doing it. I don't know. Well, let's just keep doing this. Oh my god. Um, yeah, not much to talk about. But I like how um, whenever Hot Wheels does like a very bland car like this, they stick a little logo on there. I think that's a series. I'm not sure. Got these two hypermites. Not much to talk about on this one. This one's uh, orange and yellow, and this one is like military. It's really cool. I think it's a treasure hunt with this little star right here. I'm not sure if uh, it's a treasure hunt or not, but that's the symbol. And it's cool, like, shark decal on the side. It's a cool hypermite. One of my favorites he's got. I collect hypermites. Yeah, like, I collect ballistics. Yep. Uh, the first edition Shark Cruiser. This is awesome. It's in decent condition. These actually go for good money on uh, eBay. It's the first ever Shark Cruiser, and Shark Cruiser is the most popular creature car. I was talking about thanks for being one of the most popular. Shark Cruiser is the most popular. It's got the cool, like, realistic shark, uh, what's the meat called? I think it's just meat, shark meat. Or they, what they, just their body, the, the actual realistic color of their body. Uh, that's not blubber. I don't know well, what I'm shark skin is made out of. about this Shark Cruiser is that it still has all its decals in good condition. The which eyes, means, like the eyes and all that teeth, yeah. it's all shiny. Uh, next up, we got this Phantom Racer, which is the exact version from Hot Wheels Velocity X with the uh, ghost colors, like white and green, with these little phantom flames on it. I always liked this uh, design for Phantom Racer. I don't even know what this thing is, but it looks cool with this paint. I didn't know, but Phantom Racer is actually copied from Lexus. Lexus made a concept car that looks just like this, and Hot Wheels used it for inspiration. Speaking of Hot Wheels Beat That, we got the off track from the game. Oh, sweet. I yeah, like this one. This is probably his favorite car for some reason. I'm not sure. It's I mean, cool, but yeah, um, not not crazy. Cool, in my opinion. It's got the number 33 on the side. Of the, well, I, always, not in the game. I always love plastic body cars. I don't know. With the metal base, like the weight of them. I don't know. I think they're cool. Uh oh. No, you got it. It's okay, not going to fall. Uh, this is Rebel's favorite that he got, with the exception of off track. It's Vulture Roadster. I think we've got every single car, like in toy model, like what Hayden's showing right now, like in the Game Boy. For Velocity, Velocity X on the Game Boy Advance. Uh, yeah, not much to say. It's got these cool tribal flames on it, but I've never been a fan of Vulture Roadster. It's always been like a weird, I don't know, whack job car, in my opinion. we got three more cars that are out of the box. we got this cool Drift King, all green. 
Oh, that's a really nice from, one. I think this is from a five pack, but I like this. I really like this. Never been a fan of Drift King. It was like the Twin Mill 3, where it was on like every single package for a Hot Wheels set. It was like overused, but I like that Drift King. Got this cool Speed Blaster with like the World Race wheels. Uh, like the red, white, I mean the red, yellow, and blue paint. It's really cool. I think they have a regular version of this without the wheels. So it's on both sides. Yeah, it's, I love Speed Blaster. It's a cool 90s looking car. I think that's going to be like the best starter of all Hot Wheels games. Only in one Hot Wheels game. Uh, I got oh, yeah. the last one that's not in the box. We got Prototype 12. Really, I don't even know why I bought this. It's very beat up and I honestly think it's boring. <laughs> Probably my least favorite car I got. Uh, <laughs> now we're going to move on to the stuff we got in the box. Uh, our aunt got us most of these. Actually, all of these. She got us all these cars at Walmart. We got this cool Amazon art car. You can film right. We have a million of those. <laughs> art cars, yeah. We don't have this one, though. Oops. Uh, yeah, we're just going to take this out. This, the box isn't in great condition, but so we're just going to open it up. Plastic body, metal base. It looks pretty cool. Amazon's like a GT car. Yeah. It's not uh, bad. Different colored wheels, different color. Turquoise. Look at These are cool. Oh man, it says the R. It's the beginning of red. Yeah, art. It's the second one in the series. Just to be honest, I don't no, like how not. the colors are like all around. Just to be honest. That's, I don't that's really what like how it. those art cars are. Yeah. Uh, speaking of art cars, you got this Fandango. I never liked Oops. Fandango because it looks like my mom's car. It looks like a Trailblazer. Oh yeah. It's I didn't very know boring. That. It's very boring for a fantasy model. And uh, ugly. Very ugly. And I think Fandango is a movie company. They do movies or something. What else? Stuff we got the Fast and the Furious. This really cool 94 Toyota Supra uh, for the Fast and the Furious 7. These are like a whole year old now. I first thought that was a Porsche. Well, it kind of looks like a 911 GT3. I know, right? With the same wheels and stuff. Stop focusing. The car's going to auto-focus. Auto you don't have to keep touching the screen. Really, really nice looking car. Best year of the Supra, in my opinion. Um... Sorry about my fingers being in the way. Just, oh, to... just keep putting your finger in the way. Don't do that. You got this 1970 Ford Escort. I love these things. I got all the Castro ones. This one's pretty cool. I like this car in the movie. It's fun. Uh, yeah. Not much to talk about. It's got the... you seen the movie, you know with this car. I like the headlights Whoa. on these things. The see-through headlights. Didn't know that it's at like all. Classic rally car with the five spokes in gold. Really nice looking when it drives. Look at it. Oh, sorry. Zoom in. Focus on. Zoom in. Focus. Oh. Focus and zoom. Oh, focus and zoom. That doesn't really matter. I just, I just like the way this car looks when it drives. That was a waste of time. Whatever. Uh, moving on. Probably my least favorite in the entire set is this Honda S2000 with snowflakes on oh, the side man. of it. I, I have to say the opposite. This is. Your favorite? I'm just kidding. The same. What were you going to say? Because uh, I hate this thing. I know. Uh, what's it called? The white one. Yeah, right, this one right here. Five you don't like that? No, I do. I like that's my favorite one. Oh, well, what, you, what were you gonna say about this one then? This is my least favorite as well. Oh, yeah. Well, this one's not that. It's cool, just ugly. Actually. I like the Honda S two thousand, but really, like orange, spoiler, orange snowflakes on it. Yeah, like that's in. like the worst paint job. Ah oh, crap. Even in the movie, I cannot stand this paint job. I mean, like, what the heck? No. And my favorite real car probably of all time my favorite non-fantasy hot wheels car i should say Isn't the 19 that the 1970 yeah the scorchers car 1970 yeah. roadrunner Char taro katano's roadrunner if the, you watch the world race movies i'm a big fan of the scorchers i love the porsche 944 924 and the roadrunner and the ferrari 348 or no five what is it four five five but whatever. Whatever. I know what I'm talking. 348, I think. The Ferrari 348. But I like these five. The 348, the Roadrunner, 1970 Roadrunner, the Porsche 924, the Porsche 944, and probably the Audi R8, the first first uh, V10. I think the 2010 V10 yeah. R8. Those are my favorite my favorite cars. But yeah, thanks for watching. Uh, we have a bunch of... Oh, that's upside down now. We have a bunch of cars here. We thought we'd make a big lot instead of a bunch of tiny videos, and I think it, it was worth it. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more videos. Bye-bye. Bye. Really?